today we are going to learn how to create database using mysql command line create tables to insert data into a table to delete data into a table to update a table okay so we are going to create database school even you can check in either school there first before you create database school okay show databases school is not there you can go ahead now to create database create database school okay terminate so school has already gone there if you you type again show databases i think you can see here show databases see it's there school already has it there you can see it here now you can now say use school school is not being changed you can now create the table for example school is having the entity of uh, is having entities like student you can have entities like staffs okay so let us create let us use uh, this time student and student is having attributes like ring number name sex date of birth phone fees okay so we create we create create table create table create table what create table student then you put the fields right now yes so i have created um, from creating table student reg number uh reg number virtual 50 not null so this is the data type and then the length and i'm saying it should not be there should not be empty and it's our primary key which means it's unique this reg number okay then name version data type is version so it's in a string format and it should not be empty gender version also not null then date date of birth so the data type of date of birth means as date okay see here then phone also a vasha our data type is vasha then it's having the length of 90 then fees it's having data type of int Have you seen here? so this one is the in the number then not null should not be empty not null let us try to enter this command and you see what happens so it says query has succeeded that's good you can say now say describe you can write even in short form describe student so student has succeeded that's good so the next step i'm going to show you how to insert values insert into i'm going to show you how to insert values in in student i'm moving together i am inserting uh, the values in student table i'm from saying insert into student reg number you you list these columns here insert into student reg number name gender date of birth phone fees the way they are here exactly then you come and say values you close the bracket say values open this bracket close okay then say values open another bracket so you put the reg number okay how about this is the name gender we're having male date of birth so date of birth here you have to be very very careful you make sure that you start with the year uh, followed by the month and then finally the date uh -huh, comma another open another double quotes you put in the phone number as it's here then amount is here fees let us try to enter this command and see what happens you have enter so it has accepted you can say now select all from student table name is it? student table name is it? number name is here gender okay you can add another value okay you can add another value so i'm trying to add another value here i'm from adding flavia just come up the way we did it first so let us enter and see and then say select select all from name is it? student you can see flavia has come but, there, but now Flavia there is a mistake with the gender I have done it adamantly to show you that we can update our 
table can update it can make change so it's a update okay yes we are together i'm trying to update this flavia for she since she's a lady we change this gender to female i've written here a command saying update student set gender here equals double quotes female where the red number this is our unique number is this this column here enter and see so you can say select all from student i think select all from student enter so flavia uh flavia is being successfully updated the next step is to delete how do we delete so delete so here at this time i'm trying to delete student called Herbert. so i have said delete from student where reg number is equals uh open double quotes 21 bit 005 umc this column here let us try to terminate and see so this student has already gone if you say back select all from student of course uh this student has already gone this is the new update of the table are we together uh -huh. so another step is we are together i'm adding another column called subject to a student i say alter table student add column subject after maybe after phone after phone other table and then you have to put data type a uh, virtual maybe uh, 50 okay not null okay then terminate and see so it has gone there already if you go to select you can see that subject has come after phone okay update it okay yes you can update by saying and set subject double quotes science where red number is equals this so this is the subject name terminate and see so it terminated enter so it says it has accepted the query you can see now science is in here good now another thing maybe we want to change uh we want to change maybe this phone to uh phone number so we want to change uh, this phone to phone number so you say alter table student change column phone and then you call this the phone which is here and then the new column is phone number okay and then virtual this terminate enter and see good you can, so, you can now say select all from student and see wow thank you so much for watching my tutorial thank you so much